Hi folks, well, we're into summer hours now, and uh, my hours got severely cut. And uh, I was looking for a way and thought I found a way to uh, increase my income for a while to get me through the summer. So I go to check it out and they want three pieces of ID, social security card, got that check, a uh, piece of mail showing your current address, got that check, and a driver's license or state ID showing your current address. I left my or driver's license or state ID expired like a year ago. So I get down to the DMV to get it renewed and lo and behold they got a sign in there closed for business. They're not doing business anymore. So they got a sign redirects me back to the state tax collector's office who's now handling state IDs and driver's licenses and such. And uh, I wait, get called back. The girl's typing it up. She goes, you know this is going to be thirty-one fifty, right? And I go, what? Thirty-one fifty? Are you shitting me? Now, mind you, five years ago when I got this thing, it was like five or five fifty, and now it's thirty-one fifty. Five years later, that's over a five hundred percent increase, people. I just got raped by the state. Now, how hard is this going to be on, you know, low-income individuals who, who live on a limited income, you know, they're on Social Security or whatnot? They're not going to be able to handle increases like that. And it's not just state governments, it's federal governments, too. I mean, uh, for example, I got my uh, uh, passport seven years ago. It was $75. And a year or a year and a half later, they increased it to $125. Now, what is that? 55, 60% increase in in a year or so? It's ridiculous. And the, and the courts are in on it too. I mean, you used to be able to go in court, pay your $15 filing fee, and sue anybody that owed you money. But now they want a percentage. That's right. If you sue them for say, I don't know, ten thousand dollars, they want five or ten percent of that, not fifteen dollars anymore. The governments are getting out of control. They take bribes from corporations so that you know they can pass laws that favor the corporations. Then they turn around, increase taxes substantially take money out of our pocket to bail out corporations that you know caused our recession in the first place and now they're raping us with uh, IDs and other taxes it's just they're out of control we gotta do something we gotta put an end to it I mean let's just take an example 7-Eleven they have to have 15 licenses business licenses just to open their doors and do business and that's for each store now if they're the price of their business license went up a hundred percent per year like this state ID just did how long do you think before the uh, 7-eleven is bankrupt and we wonder why our corporations are taking our jobs to other countries it's ridiculous.